We're here at ITU Telecom World 2019 in Budapest, Hungary, and I'm very pleased to be joined in the studio today by Professor Umar Gaba Dambata, who is the Executive Vice Chairman and CEO of the Nigerian Communications Commission. Professor Dambata, welcome to the studio. Thank you very much, Max. It's, it's great, a pleasure to be here. Great to see you. Yes. Great to see great you. Great to see you too. Uh, now, I'd like to start off. Uh, we'll we'll talk about innovating uh, together, innovation that matters. It's the theme of this year's event. What uh, makes connectivity meaningful? And why is it so important, do you think? Well, uh, connectivity is uh, meaningful and necessary um, for the delivery of services. If connectivity is not available, is not accessible, then you know, the, the services that we intend to render through those um, uh, opportunities, you know, they will not be there. People will not be connected. People will not have access to services that will in turn transform their lives. That will in turn lead to what we call social and um, economic transformation of economies and societies. In terms <coughs> of innovative policy, what single factor uh, or, or innovative policy can best accelerate digital transformation in your opinion? Well, let us look at digital transformation. What are the exciting opportunities of digital transformation. Improvement of learning, so, you know, uh, putting in place sustained and shared prosperity, creating a competitive and innovative economy. You know, the list is endless. Um, facilitating a more open, mobile and cohesive society. How do you do all this? How do you reach out to the millions of people who are yearning to benefit from these opportunities? This can be achieved through the deployment of infrastructure. By addressing the infrastructure deficits in our individual countries, we can bring all these opportunities to the doorsteps of our citizens. And that is what we are doing in Nigeria. And how is Nigeria working uh, towards an, in an inclusive digital economy? We are doing this by ensuring we deploy, like I said, the necessary infrastructure. The country, the entire country, has been divided into seven zones as I'm talking to you. Each zone has been assigned an infrastructure company to deploy broadband infrastructure. The idea is to make wireless and fixed broadband infrastructure ubiquitous. This, if we can do, we hope, will lead to the rollout of broadband services that will in turn impact positively on citizens transformation socially and economically. And what about 5G? What progress is Nigeria making in 5G deployment? And what are the challenges and opportunities linked to that? We are, like all countries, trying to roll out proof of concept trials. We don't want to be caught unprepared when eventually 5G is with us. To do that, we need to involve the security agencies and uh, get the permission of the federal government you know, to start the proof of concept. In preparation for doing this, we have resolved some, you know, spectra, 26, 38, and 42 giga, 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 gigahertz. And um, the idea is to do a trial with a view to ascertaining the signal strengths in locations that will provide 5G services. The, the particular usage scenario we're interested in is enhanced broadband services you know, among the other, you know, the, 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 the three scenarios. The reason for this is we feel broadband can be used to transform other sectors of the economy, transform governance, and therefore, by targeting these key sectors of the economy, we will be transforming the entire country. There are many people here who I'm sure will, will wholeheartedly agree with you. I wanted to ask you, what's the value for you of attending events such as ITU Telecom World? As always, Max, we attend ITU Telecom World in order to benefit from global best practices, in order to find out what is going on in other economies, to borrow from their experiences, and also for you know, sharing of ideas on how we deploy services you know, in the area of emerging technologies, AI. 5G, Internet of Things, coming here will enrich our experience on how best we are going to do this.
Well, thank you very much for sharing your insights with us, and, and we look forward to catching up with you again, as we have done uh, on numerous occasions uh, again in the future. Thanks a lot very much. It's always a pleasure to talk to you, Max. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.